Hello everyone and welcome back to the channel HR with HP. In today's video, I'll be doing a compressed step-by-step -step of how to get your CHRP designation from the Human Resource Professional Association in Ontario. So let's get started. So first and foremost, even before starting anything, you have to be a member of the association HRPA. Either you start off as a student member, I would recommend that, or you become an ordinary member, and then everything starts. So you pay your membership fees, you are the member, that's the first step. Second step, you give your transcripts to get your coursework authenticated. What do I mean by that? I will share my experience. I went to business school out here for a human resource program. I submitted the college, submitted my transcripts directly for the courses that were essential to sit for the CHRP exam. And then after the HRPA says, yes, all the course requirements are met. I've made another video for that. What courses are required for the designation? then go ahead and pay for the exam. So there are two exams. First is the knowledge exam and then is the employment law exam. I get a lot of questions. Can I give the employment law exam first before the knowledge exam? The answer is no. First, you give your knowledge exam, be it the CHRP or the CHRL. You have to give the knowledge exam first and then the employment law exam. So you pay the fee, give the knowledge exam, you pass that, then you move on to paying the employment law examination fee, sit for that exam, and then you are successful in that. Then both the examinations you've passed. Third step, which is I would say in my case was quite simple. It's the job ready program. So I hope this video helps you. Please go through the website, which is hrpa.ca for the latest and the most official information. I gave my designation exam, what I've explained to you in 2021. It is 2023 currently. Some things might have changed and I have been updating all that on my channel as well. So I hope this helped. If this helps you, please do let me know in the comment section below. And if you have any more questions for clarifications, please do let me know in the comment section below. And if you like this video, please hit the thumbs up. If you've not yet subscribed, please do subscribe to my channel. I make human resource related content for everybody. So again, thank you very much and see you next week. Bye. Thank you.